go. I just want to do a stream. However, I had a lot of homework that needed to get done. Alright, don't mind that. So, I thought of the wonderful idea to stream homework live on YouTube. You know, what could go wrong? Nothing could go wrong. It's a great plan. You know, so quarantine be hitting different though. That's kind of the slogan of this stream. You know, y'all could be watching Fortnite or Minecraft, but, you know, we're just going to be doing some good old homework. <laughs> Uh-oh. My microphone was being a bit mad, so I'm having to turn it down a bit. Alright, how's that? I'm like having to listen to myself. Alright, whatever. It's fine. Who just gotta change the thumbnail? I hope that the sound is doing good though because it was kind of mad at me when I just checked it. There we go. Thumbnail uploaded. And this stream is literally me just doing homework. I have homework that I need to do, but I was wanting to do a stream. So here we are. <laughs> Alright. I think my microphone is a bit happier with me now. I hope so though. As it was acting a bit weird. Let's see. Alright, now it's a bit too quiet. Alright. Hopefully that's fixed. Let's get on some homework. I have a list here of different tasks that I must do. So, we gotta do some biology. Alright. Miss Pleaso. Now, biology is tough, especially in quarantine, because with me, I need it to be described, you know? I can't just teach myself how to do <laughs> stinking biology. Amy plays RB. Hello, what's up? How is it going? All right. And my voice is a bit dry. I need to get some singing Gatorade or something. Anywho, we're going to be learning about the brain today, all right? <laughs> Actually, no, let's do Bioman. Bioman in the past. It's interesting. You will see. It's this thing. Each teacher that, you know, at least doesn't want you to be completely bored. They all have this website where, okay, wait. Bioman Bio. Sign into Bioman Bio. Okay. So Bioman Bio is a very interesting website. You'll see what I mean. You'll definitely see what I mean. <laughs> This is the website. Oh, yo, YouTube channel. That's ironic. All right. So, Bioman Bio. It looks like it was legit made in 2004. I wouldn't be surprised if it was. I'm just pulling up YouTube on my phone so that I can actually read the chat. That just seems kind of helpful. Wow, we got two people watching me doing homework. Good you. Also, what grade are you in? I am a good old freshman. Good old freshman. You know, great way to start high school <laughs> by having to do quarantine with this coronavirus. All right, so where did it say to go? Don't want that. I have too many tabs open. All right. Click human systems. How do I do that? <laughs> oh, body system? Maybe? Is that close enough? Hopefully. Oh my gosh. Okay. It says to sign in. I don't... Where do I even sign in? When I put in my info, I'll have to change it to a different view so you guys don't steal my info like the little sneaks that you are. <laughs> Alright. Students, maybe? I legit don't know. Why use Bioman? It's free and it's fun. This just looks like a whole lot of fun. Alright, where do I do this? Begin a new game, click Journey of the Gases, play the entire game. Take quiz, once you finish the quiz, go back to the main menu and submit to the teacher. Alright. I legit don't know how to sign in. <laughs> but it looks like that we have to go here. Let's just do this. Click Human Systems, click under virtual games wow it's a virtual game you know it's not in real life we aren't playing soccer about physiology i don't know if i'm saying that correctly
Okay. Click Respiratory Journey. Oh, Respiratory Journey. How did I say that wrong? <laughs> Alright. Respiratory Journey. Begin new game. I think that's what it said to do. Alright, I don't want to do a quiz. So that would actually need me to think. So yeah, Respiratory Journey. Click Begin a new game. Click under Journey of Gases. Oh gosh. Alright. Respiratory journey intro. The respiratory journey and circulatory systems work together to maintain homeostasis of gases in the body. Specifically, they make it possible for your cells to get oxygen and get rid of carbon dioxide waste. All right, epic. We'll begin by following oxygen gas into your respiratory tract to see where it ends up. Oxygen first enters through the mouth or nose, not shown, and passes through the throat. Click next to begin. Whoa, okay. Oh, this is, this is a bit mu Oh, wait. Oh, I can... Oh, I tell it where to go. Alright, come on down, Mr. Oxygen. Alright, you are now moving through the trachea. I have to click. It's like Animal Crossing. Well, I'm in fifth grade. I'm going to stay and learn. <laughs> Alright, we'd be learning on Shockma Channel. Um, two bronchi branch off of the trachea. Like, trachea, I guess, is like your throat, essentially. One goes left to the right. To the right lung. Let's go to the right lung. You have entered bronchias and now you are inside of a lung. I want to go out though. Oh, it won't let me. <laughs> I'm stuck inside the bronchus. Okay. Um, Mark, I branch into smaller and smaller tubes called the bronch... Okay, I don't know how to say that. Getting... <laughs> are getting smaller and smaller. Let's shrink your oxygen molecule. How do you shrink a molecule? Okay, I shouldn't ask. Bronchioles end at the... Ravioli, <laughs> tiny air sacs where gas exchange takes place. Tap on ravioli to zoom in on one now. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know how to say that. Towards the left, because ravioli are the sites of gas exchange, we are going to spend a little more time focusing on what occurs at them. Mom, why are you laughing behind me? <laughs> why are you even here to begin with? <laughs> I'm teaching people how to do biology over here, all right? <laughs> No, you didn't. You had, like... Wait, actually, yeah, you did. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> okay, I need to do my ravioli. Um, okay, because the ravioli are the sites of gas exchange, we are going to spend a little more time focusing on what occurs at them. Oh, wait. Oh, I can move the oxygen. Oh, oh, okay. I don't know how. Notice the high concentration of oxygen in your ravioli due to breathing in. Perform diffusion by moving the oxygen from high to low concentration. Be sure each one gets picked up by a red blood cell. Oh, okay. Bam. Bam. Oh, oh. Bam. Wait, will it just stop? It just stops for me. <laughs> oh, I have to do it there. Okay. Notice that the oxygen you breathe in passes into your blood here. This is critical to survival because cells all over your body need oxygen to stay alive. Well, imagine your teacher is watching. <laughs> I should just send a stream to her. That'd be great. All right. Capillaries. Capitalism. No. Connect to form. <laughs> all right. Capillaries connect to form small veins, venules that all merge to form. What? Pulmonary. <laughs> Pulmonary vein that carries oxygen rich blood to the left side of the heart. Oh, wait. Do I need to drag them? Yeah! Oh, jeez, he's a speedy boy. Wow. Alright. Tap or click. Oh, I couldn't read it. Oxygen-rich blood from the lungs enters at the heart at the left... Okay. Through the pulmonary veins. This is how to give my mother an evil death stare. That was rough. All right, the left ultrum is an upper chamber of the heart. Click on it to bring oxygenated blood into the heart. Note, the left side of the heart will be on your right. Remember, you are looking at the front of someone else's heart. They couldn't just make it simple. They had to make it smart. Whoa. Okay. I just randomly clicked and I got it. Epic. Good job. The left ultrum pumps blood to the net. To wow. All right. <laughs> What does this even mean? <laughs> Click on the left ventricle to watch the blood pump into it. Wow. Can't even talk. Um, 
won't. I don't know what to click. <laughs> I don't know how to do biology. No. No. Okay. Well, I need the blood to pass. Is it just like... Are you okay? <laughs> He's coughing over there. Do you need to be quarantined? <laughs> and why are you... I still don't understand why you're in the room that we use for streaming. You're just vibing over there. Well, this is so funny. Only us can make biology homework funny. Ventricle. And that is a fact. Ventricle. All right. The left ventricle. Please. Where is the... Maybe you have to drive. Ah! You have to click I don't know how to do this. Maybe you have to click and drag. You've been stuck on here. Ventricle oh is forced. God, click and drag. Oh wait, no, click and dragging won't work. You're not clicking. Wow. Alright. <laughs> the fact that you cannot read half of it. <laughs> no, and I'm in ninth grade as well. I should be smart, but I don't even know what a ventricle is. Um, watch, click on the left ventricle to watch the left ultram pump blood into it. Notice that the valve separates the left ultram. Atrium! Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh! Oh, we did it! Yeah! Alright! The left ventricle has thick muscle in the strongest part of the heart. This is because it pumps blood into the rest of your body. It pumps through the aorta. 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 <laughs> the largest artery in the body. Use Google well. No! We shall not use Google. We have to figure this out from our own smarts. Can we zoom in on this a little bit? Ah, alright. Get out of here, ad. All right, let's just scroll up a little bit. All right, respiratory journey. The left ventricle has thick muscle. Why is it just like slightly moving? It's weird. Okay, click on the order and notice how the blood pump. Ah, oh, that's weird. I don't like, oh, it's pumping. We did it. All right, good job. Oh, so it just wants us to repeat it. All right, we are making a heart work. Yeah, all right, next. From the old, this is the same screen as a couple slides ago. They, they just rotated it slightly. Okay, whatever. The From the aorta, blood travels into other arteries that eventually branch into tiny capillaries. This is where oxygen diffuses into the adjacent cells. Epic. Tap or click to steer. Oh, oh, your oxygenated red blood cell through the artery to capillaries that will deliver its oxygen to body cells. I want to go back though. I can't go back. Oh, well. Um, let's go through this guy. No? Yes? Yeah, all right. Here we are zoomed out on one of the microscopic capillaries that is delivering oxygen to the body cells. Man, I'm reading so much better than I was just two minutes ago. This is helpful. All right. So is this what the dude... Oh, that's the body cell. Okay. I'm dying of laughter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm legit just doing biology. <laughs> Alright, perform diffusion of oxygen molecules into body cells. Drag the oxygen from the red body cell from the red blood cells into the body cell mitochondria. Mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. That's the only thing that I know. There they are used to make up ATB cell energy into cell respiration. Oh, oh, no, come back! Aw. Oh. i I hear someone in Discord. Hello. Oh, it just stops there. That's helpful. Okay, gonna go the long way around. I want that one. I see that you're doing science. Yes, I am doing science. I'm doing it dang well, thank you very much. Stark internship! <laughs> Gotta get... My thing. <laughs> no, I'm gonna get the Stark internship. Stark internship! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at all the ATP that we're making, though. Next. All right, I need to turn on my Discord a little bit. I can barely hear you. What? All right, let's turn down our music just a bit. Turn this up a bit. Okay, now I can hear your random squeaks. <laughs> All right, perform diffusion. Oh, now I can hear you. Oh, oh, we're going to the lungs. All right. 
Hang on, I'm having to concentrate on science over here. Alright, carbon dioxide now flows through the capillaries. What? If you have a question, you can just go to the blue. Never. I have to find this out with my smarts. <laughs> with my ultra big brain. Back to larger brain. Than you. You know that. Yes, I could make a list of people that are. However, today. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, you know, thank goodness that it is because it would be way too long. All right, click next to watch a carbon dioxide molecule make its journey to the heart. All right. Also, there is low pressure in veins. Um, I'm in like standard bio, or I don't know, like advanced bio. I legit don't know. All I know is that we're learning about the heart right now. Good job. The blood full of CO2 has entered the heart. I honestly don't know. I thought capillaries were caterpillars. <laughs> um, but yeah, I yes. <laughs> I legit don't know what my next classes are going to be because of this quarantine. Click next, watch carbon dioxide molecule make its journey towards capillaries. Yeah, but that's too much effort. It's okay. It's so funny how these slides are getting reused over and over again, just rotated slightly. Oh, now we're back in the aviolis. Oh, all right, go on, little CO2. The carbon dioxide. Oh, okay, man, that's going really quick. We'll now zoom out to watch the carbon dioxide travel out of the lung. Let's do that. We're getting a CO2 on out of here. Okay. Click, click, click. Oop, I've I've gotten snagged. Uh oh. Alright, we have left the lung and have entered the trachea. You're almost done breathing out carbon dioxide. Oh god. I've now entered the voice box. Carbon dioxide will now continue toward the mouth and nose where you will expel. <laughs> Got it. There's a video titled Baby Yoda Macron. <laughs> Let's not worry about that. Hey Leo, how's it going? I kinda want it was adorable. I kinda wanna Please. You really shouldn't. I don't think it's good. Um, schoolwork, I see. Yes, we have five viewers, all of which that are watching me do biology science. Um, I, th I think that we're also going to be getting a pizza delivery soon. <laughs> Alright, congratulations. Now you have seen the oxygen and breathe. I guess your cells using cell respiration. Return the main menu. That was it? Oh. I'm not even watching Okay, um. Journey of gases. Um, oh, we already did that. Alright, we have to take the quiz now. What right. mic are you using, Lol? Is it, it's my normal mic. Does it sound okay? I legit don't know. No. It sounds so far away. Oh, I do? Um, not, is it better now? Oh, how about now? I legit don't know. Hello there. <clears throat> oh my gosh. How about now? How about now? Oh my gosh, how? On my screen, it's like going all the way through the red. Leah, how is my microphone? I don't trust you. <laughs> Alright, well, we have to do a quiz. We have to do a quiz. I'm legit doing the quiz. Start the quiz. Alright, what is the overall purpose of the respiratory system? Um. 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 It doesn't digest stuff. Hurts my ears. Oh, gosh. Oh, everyone's saying help. I've just, oh, uh, I've just ear massacred my entire stream. I'm so sorry. Oh no. Oh no. Is this better? Turn it down. Oh no. What have I done? Oh no. I don't want to be deaf. <laughs> be sure to complete homeostasis while we're at it. What have I done? My ears. Oh no. 
accidentally just turned up the volume all the way and just completely destroyed everyone's eardrums. <laughs> oh. oh no. What about the Stark internship? Better. Okay. I'll take better. Um. Yeah, I'm correct. Alright. When you breathe in, air passes through several structures of your respiratory tract. Put the following in order from first to last. Um, if you don't get that right the first time, I'm gonna get it wrong. Well, it starts with the mouse or nose. Yeah. Trachea. Then it goes to the trachea. Alright. And then I think the bronc <laughs> guy. No, you didn't. And then ravioli. Yeah, I'm correct. All right. Oh my gosh, my mom was just in the background saying start internship, and now my dog is upset. This is great. All right, drag the appropriate labels. So we got the trachea, then the bronchi. All right, we're correct. We are smart. All right, oxygen that we breathe passes. Oh. Oxygen that we breathe in passes through air passageways. Wow, that makes no sense. And now our the air sacs. Um, I think it was ventricles? Right? Oh my god. I don't know. Was it this? Yeah. Oh no! Oh no! Okay. Well, it was none of these. That's helpful. Alveoli. <laughs> All right. Oxygen that we breathe in passes through air passageways that end in the air sacs. What are these air sacs called? Um, isn't this the same question that we just had? It's is it ravioli? I legit don't know. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. You don't know. Next. I don't pay attention. I was. Too busy making an epic commentary of doing biology. <laughs> ah, all right. What happens to the oxygen that enters the blood, or enters the alveoli? Um, I think it goes into the blood, right? Yeah. Next, all right. How is the oxygen transported in the blood? Oxygen is a lie I only breathe from the right. <laughs> Who needs oxygen, am I right? You're a life student. Wait, what do you mean? Is my is my sound still weird? Alright. How's oxygen transport in the bed? Thank No. I'm turning it up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh no! Why microphone? Why? Alright, we're unplugging this microphone. I'm fixing something. Oh god. Oh, oh Hello there. We now have a new microphone because the other one was a boomer and didn't want to work. Hopefully this one sounds a bit better. Hold on, your live stream is just like a few minutes. Or not the next one. Oh hey Spaghetti Spaghetti, how are you? Wait, is... Am I talking in a Discord? Okay, you're good. You're good. I'm good? Yeah! You're good. Okay. Carried by the red blood cells. Yes. What is the oxygen you breathe in used for? Um... Used to make ATP. <laughs> yes. Alright. 88%. We're doing good. Better be. Alright. What happened to the carbon dioxide shown in the diagram? It becomes oxygen, diffuses into blood. No, it doesn't disintegrate, jeez. Diffuses into the alveoli. Yeah, alright. 
we learned stuff. I'm so proud of us. All right, where did this carbon dioxide come from? It was produced as a waste product. Yes. Yeah. All right. After diffusing into the ravioli, what happens to carbon dioxide? Um, you have Instagram. Yeah, I don't really post anything, but on Instagram, it's just literally called Shockma. Or it might be Shockma YT. I legit can't remember. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's Shockma YT. All right. After diffusing into the ravioli, why are you just saying wow? <laughs> okay, that's fair. Um, what happens to carbon dioxide? It gets exhaled. Yeah, it just gets exhaled. We are correct. Alright. Well, thank you, Mr. Pizza Guy. Alright, the blood... We just got pizza. <laughs> the blood vessels labeled A to the right are carrying blood from body cells to the right atrium of the heart. What would be true of this blood? Um, no, just cheese. Spaghetti, spaghetti's in wow. a ten. That's fun. Tents are cool. Unholy swine. Hey, cheese pizza is good. And no one can change my mind. In my backyard. Ooh. Backyard camping. Alright. Noise. Alright, what would be true of this blood? Okay. From body cells. High in carbon dioxide, right? Yeah! We can science. We can science. No, you can't. Yeah, Shockma's Instagram is Shockma YT, A A K A Yeet Delete. That is correct. <laughs> All right. Which of the following are true of the human heart? Deoxygenated blood is in the right side of the heart. Ventricles are the lower chambers of the heart. Uh, oxygenated blood on the left side of the heart. All right. All these are true, right? Yeah. All right. Where does the. I wasn't paying attention. Deoxygenated <laughs> blood and the right ventricle get pumped in and why? Alright, we didn't learn anything about the kidneys. Um I didn't hear a single thing you said. Or actually no, not hear. I didn't listen to a single thing you said. <laughs> Alright, we are correct. I didn't feel like listening to you, okay? <laughs> okay, that's fair. <laughs> Where did the shock boy go? Y'all can hear me, right? Yeah. Okay. My phone has 2%. I'm going to let it charge so I can get decent battery. Be right back. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, we don't want you dying over there. All right. The blood in the pulmonary veins labeled B is coming from the lungs. What is true of this blood? It is low in both oxygen and carbon dioxide. It is high in both oxygen and carbon dioxide. Hmm. Coming from the lungs. So it's probably like that. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, man, we're back at 87%. Is that a good thing? F in the chat for Leo's battery percentage. Yes, indeed. All right. Okay, none of these then? I don't know. Okay, that's correct. Phew. All right, where does the oxygenated blood in the left ventricle get pumped to and why? I think we... Oh, yeah, full screen. All right, nice. Wait, what? I just went full screen over here. All right. Do the okay. kidneys be filtered? We didn't learn anything about the kidneys. <laughs> Left ventricle. All right. Okay. I think it just to the body cells. Yeah, we are correct. Nice. All right. Drag the appropriate labels. That's the aorta. Then would that be left ventricle? All right. Dude, this guy's on Instagram asking me what? <laughs> Hey, we're having to get some epic, like, or, yeah, block them. Yeah, just block them. Um, we're having to do some epic biology. Oh, jeez, I forgot to like my own stream. Oof. Alright, I forgot to, yeah, I always like my own stream. Okay, drag the appropriate. Kind of depressing, What? I like my stuff. Okay, drag the appropriate labels to where they should go. <laughs> hey! Alright, that'd be the vein. Hmm. 
like the artery. I've heard stuff about arteries. Maybe Wait, the capillary there. Oh. <laughs> Schmidt. Oh no. Okay, artery there then. Oh no. We're having a problem. What kind of problem? I'm at 76. I'm losing all of my percentage. No, 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 no. Yes. No, this is bad. Good. Oh, no. Oh, yes. We're at 70%. Chat, I need your help. Because I don't know what to pick. We're at 70%. So if we get this wrong, then I'll have a D. Don't help him. No, please. I need help. <laughs> Yes. Are you better at math or science? I don't know. I don't like either of them. But I was on the math team. What are you so science? I, I don't know. Just I, cool. I'm not interested in cells and stuff. I like I do like meteorology. And like engineering. <laughs> yeah. And how could you not? It's, it's cool. Maybe I know, right? Eh? Dang it, sixty seven percent chat! Ah. I'm legit about to call my mom and get her info because she's good at science. No, don't. We've gone from a 90% to 67 on one question. Oops. Yeah, I don't want to Google it, but asking chat for help is like asking a classmate, so that's okay. Yes, yes, it is. Seriously. <laughs> oh, I've been watching or re watching all the Harry Potter movies again. <laughs> um, go, you have. Oh, do you have a Google Mini you were trying to talk to? No, I don't have a Google Mini. I have an Alexa. Wait, can you ask Alexa? <laughs> okay. No. Um, what transports blood away from the heart? I, th I feel like it's a vein. What transports... Alright, teacher, if you ever see this, I'm sorry. I don't want to get this <laughs> wrong. So, yeah, the arteries. I, I knew that. I said that at the very beginning. Did you really? Yes, I did. I thought you said vein. No, I didn't say veins. Why'd I say veins? And I think I said no. Hi, Wishing Gamer. How are you? <laughs> um, I have no idea. Yeah, no, you should definitely block them. Wait a second. Okay, I thought... Oh, two from the heart. Alright. Let's try that. Okay, what transfers blood to the heart? It's also arteries. What? Nani? Okay, so veins are, are what transports blood toward the heart. So then capillaries are like that. Yeah, 68%. All right. Oh, no. Gosh dang it. Thin walled, thick walled, and muscular to withstand pressure. I feel like a vein would do that. Has valves to prevent backflow. Oh no, what was that? Oh man. Gosh dang it. Stop paying attention to me so many times. That's not nice. <laughs> Alright. Microscopic with a very thin layer of epith I don't know how to say that. <laughs> um maybe capillary? Yeah? Walled at muscular to stand pressure. No. I feel like a vein. Or wait. Yeah, it was whatever was going back to the heart. So then it was like that. Yeah! First try! We got 69%. Did I trim my hair? Yeah, um, the video was on pause. <laughs> wow. I think that we have to do the quiz again. <laughs> yeah, we have to do the quiz again. <laughs> uh, 
100%. We just need to do this really quick. Just like that. Nice. Alright. Trachea. Then the bronchi. Submit response. Nice. Okay, what were these called? Dang it! Was it the ravioli? Nice. Okay, what happens to the oxygen that enters the ravioli? Stays in the ravioli, becomes carbon dioxide, diffuses into the lung. Ah, blood. Right. Okay. We're actually making good progress. We were just joking around earlier, but we gotta get this. We gotta get that good grade over here, alright? Alright, what is the oxygen transported into the blood? Carried by red blood cells. I think it's just carried by blood cells, right? I wasn't thinking nice. what you're saying. What? We're doing this quiz again because I didn't get a good grade. Alright, hi Jelly. That's my dog, if anyone didn't know. Ted blood cells. <laughs> Next. What is the oxygen? Yeah. So respiration. We said eliminate. Yeah, okay. What happens to the carbon dioxide shown in the diagram? It doesn't disintegrate. It diffuses into the ravioli. Alright, where did this carbon dioxide come from? It comes from the liver and gallbladder only. No, it comes from the waste of cell respiration. Nice! Alright. After diffusing into ravioli, what happens to carbon dioxide? It gets exhaled. Nice. Okay. Oh, now we have to do this again. The blood, the blood vessels labeled A to the right are carrying blood from the body cells to the right atrium of the heart. What would be true of this blood? It is low in both oxygen and carbon dioxide. Hmm, no. It wasn't that. Nice, okay. I need to get glasses. Yeah, and you had the video pause as well. That's a rip. <laughs> Alright, which of the following are not true about the human heart? Read the options. They were all true. Okay. Didn't learn about the kidneys. I don't know why they keep on saying the kidneys. Or they didn't even mention it in the game or whatever. Um, where it's deoxygenated blood in the right ventricle to get pumped to, and why? Body cells to deliver carbon dioxide and pick up oxygen. Body cells, doot, 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 doot. Alright. Deoxygenated blood. Come on. Oh, it gets pumped. Because it's deoxygenated. Pick up oxygen and get rid of the carbon dioxide, right? Yes! 100% so far, yeah! I'm fine with it not staying at 100, but I just want to get a better than a stinking D. Alright, the blood in the pulmonary veins labeled B is coming from the lungs. What is true of this blood? Coming from B. So it would be high in oxygen and low in carbon dioxide. Yes! Alright, where is the oxygenated blood in the... Jelly. And the left ventricle get pumped to and why? What? The dog's nose for me. <laughs> Boop. Oh, she licked my hand. Good girl. <laughs> Alright, where is the... Snoop. Yeah, she's been booped. Where is the oxygenated blood in the left ventricle get pumped to and why? Um, it'd be sent to deliver oxygen. Right? Yeah. Bam. Now we're doing really good. That'll be the left ventricle. Oh god. We still have a hundred. Goodness. Oh gosh, here's this thing. Okay. Going back to Google. <laughs> the arteries carry away from the heart. Not about to get a zero because I messed up on this again. Get a zero. 
No, not correct. Dang it, there goes the 100%. Ah, man. Ah. All right, well, we got a second try. Dang. That stinks, though. What's that low pressure? That would be capillary. Vein. Artery. Oh, no. Chat, we've we've had a oops. We've had a very big That's oops. Cool. I am too, and I'm like streaming. <laughs> Thin walled. <laughs> like that. Artery. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Yes, okay. 86. We got 86. Yeah. All right. I don't want to leak my name because my mom would get would kill me. So Yeah, I don't mind about leaking my name, but there we go. Now you get to look at a game. <laughs> and I also don't want to leak my teacher's email. I I doubt that anyone would actually do anything. But you know, I just want to be safe. I want to respect her privacy and all that. My dad. What? Okay. Typed in. Done. Oh, and I think my sister ordered Wingstop. Teacher's register. What? <laughs> Man, fifth period. I'm also gonna take a picture of this. Uh, spaghetti, spaghetti's got to go. All right, see you, dude. Thanks for coming and watch me literally do homework. Bye. And yes, what's up, Leo? I don't think anyone wants to see Upload score. I'm also gonna take a pic of this. Just wanna be safe. Okay, back to the main menu. I'm gonna keep that tab open just in case anything weird happens. And there we go. We can stop looking at a game capture. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Okay. Back to this. So we are done with biology. I'm not about to do math. I don't want to do math. Math is doo doo. Sort of help you, though. Sort of, not really. I don't want to deal with it, though. I just don't want to have to do that right now. So, I think that what we should do, if my computer wants to work, because it's just completely lagged right now. That's fun. What? Um, did you get the Nightbot I was telling you about? No, no, it's okay. I mean, since you're a mod and stuff, and I'm pretty much monitoring my stream, right, like, all the time. Uh, I don't think that we really need it. Okay. Back to this. I can hear myself, huh? Okay. Yeah, so what should we do? Let me check my list. I'll also have my pizza. Your boring, bland cheese pizza. Hey, squad. Oh, yeah, let's learn about the brain. Oh, the brain's easy. Mm -hmm. So, I do not know about it. Brain time. What? I just can't pronounce the name. Animal names are just the stupidest things. <laughs> no, these are actually really funny. <laughs> I like how you say you gotta go, and then you just come back saying animal names are just the stupidest things. Okay, whatever. Brain basics. Oh no, sea palms. Oh no. Oh no. I'm having PTSD. I can't you there. Yeah. I can't help you there. I don't blame you. I really can't. Alright. Type this in. Well, I'm currently playing a game, so I'm gonna read it. 
Okay, where's the search thing? Here to see palms. Doobity do. Where do I search? Search box put that. Oh, resource tab. And to search phrase, I can put in. No, we don't want cpalms.org. Gosh dang it. We want that. Control V. Oh my gosh. I can't copy and paste. There we go. E for everyone. Brain Basics. Yes, we got it. Welcome to Brain Basics. Oh, he's talking. An interactive science what? tutorial for students like you. The brain isn't just one big blob sitting in your head. It's actually divided into many distinct parts. By the end of this tutorial, you should be able to name the major regions of the brain and identify them on a diagram. You gonna do song requests? Not right now. We're having to learn about Before this. You begin, you'll need yes, to know about the role cells having to learn about the brain. And how organs and organ systems play a role in keeping you alive. I mean, I can't help. When learning this. about anatomy, we also need to review some directional vocabulary to help us orient ourselves when we talk about body systems. Copyright strike Most incoming. Can be Name doesn't the matter. And it um. Is to have wait, why? <laughs> Is C-Palms about a copy strike me? Anterior or posterior. For example, your head is anterior to your feet. Uh-oh. To describe front, I'm kidding. Back, it's fine. We say ventral and dorsal. For example, a Are dolphin's sure dorsal fin is yeah. attached. To describe left and right, we always sure. use the organism. Yeah, left I'm pretty right sure. When the organism's ventral side is facing us, we call this anatomical left and anatomical right. All right, that's the brain for you guys. Now we're going to practice what we just. Oh, saw. what? Using the skeleton. No, I don't. Guide. I don't know. When learning about anatomy, each term with the correct. Oh, come on. Anatomy. Okay, whatever. Um, B is the dorsal. I know that. I like how someone randomly just joined the stream saying a copyright strike is coming. <laughs> yes. Okay. Dorsal. Um. Uh, bam. Bada bing. Bada boom. I don't know what I'm putting. Ventral. Big brief. Submit. Every part. What? Oh, come on. Okay. Bada. Ah, oh, man. Remember that each term is okay. Just, with just let me skip it, please. Continue. Just there we go. Like All right. Nature, the, brain, the brain. Yes, the brain. Here's a hint on who I am. Mr. Name doesn't matter. Each of these major divisions perform a different function and function together to make your body work. Also, each of these regions is divided what? into even smaller areas. Which brain looking kind of fresh, though. Functions. Fun fact. The upper portion my main of my name starts with an H. Actions and learning. H. J. Jugan. Your brain is learning. And my mouth is full. I'm sorry. Now for some practice. The brain is divided into how many regions? Three. Use the box to type in your answer. Three, I tell you. The way you're Harry Potter. <laughs> if you look closely, you'll notice that your brain is not just one single piece, but it is actually divided into many. Smaller pieces. For the largest part of your brain, the cerebrum, we call the Close, I'm Hayden. Hey! How you doing, Hayden? Lobes has its own name. In the front part of your brain is the frontal. If y'all know, that's actually my cousin. <laughs> the base of your skull. How you been? How's quarantine? These are right next to your temples. Just I'm doing good. I thought you were another weird troll or something. <laughs> yeah, quarantine be hitting different though. <laughs> Each of these performs several different functions for your body. Here's a way to remember it. Starting from the frontal lobe, remember the acronym FTOP. You're Harry Potter, you're trying to hide it. Oh my gosh. To posterior, to dorsal, to anterior. 
need to turn down the lo-fi a little bit. Alright, I need to turn down my actual volume. It won't let me turn down my volume. There we are. That's better. At least for me, I don't know if it is for you guys. Hey yo, Hayden. Just because I may look like a troll doesn't mean I am one. Well, I mean, most of the time when someone looks like a troll, they are. <laughs> Let's see how you do at locating the lobes of the cerebro. Identify the frontal lobe by clicking Dude. the appropriate location on the screen. Right, it's literally the one in the front. Help. Remember your FTOP hint. I don't remember anything about FTOP. I just know that the frontal is in the front. You thought you were a troll lol. <laughs> Temporal. Um, when you're ready. That guy? Okay, well, that is Sorry. that guy. It's the pink this guy. Sounds like one. Let's try another one. Hey, where's the occipital lobe on this? That graphic? one. X yeah. Click on the parot. All right, we can we can Let's identify the brain. Oh no. Using the diagram. Okay, a is key, frontal. The matching lobe from B the drop-down options at the right. When you're finished, is submit the optical. <laughs> But in all serious, seriousness, my quarantine is going all right. My dad has to go back to work. They're reopening his store. Yeah, nice. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm in a tent. <laughs> oh my gosh. How about you? I'm literally stuck inside. I can't do anything. And my increasing amount of insanity has led me to stream biology homework on YouTube. So, uh, that's fun. <laughs> Seems legit. Yeah. Okay, um, that was temporal. No, that D was temporal. Yeah, the all right. The cerebrum is the largest part of the brain. There is another important part of the brain called the cerebellum. It's the cerebellum looks weird. Posterior to the cerebrum, it has a different look and texture from the cerebrum. This part of the brain helps things like balance. Cerebellum means I'm in a green tent. I am in my so recliner. <laughs> the at the back of the brain, you know that's the cerebellum. Also, why are there little scissors on the cerebellum or whatever? Posterior to the cerebrum is the brain stem. The brain stem controls basic body function. Fair enough. I just don't want my dad to bring the virus home to my family. Yeah, true. In all seriousness, I really hope that you know everything's safe and stuff, especially since his job is reopening. Oranges. Been in the house all day, buddy. So I've been in my house for like over a month. Pony crushing oranges. <laughs> Mid brain ponds. Now, okay. let's practice the lower brain anatomy. I don't know this. No, I was goofing off of my stream. Dang it. Okay. The blue thing is the midbrain. The blue thing is the pogs. <laughs> been in the tent all day. <laughs> Medulla. So. Medulla. A would be Pogs. Pogs in chat. <laughs> C. Red brain? Maybe? Um. Cerebellum. Yes, sir. Nah, man. Okay, well. We don't actually have to do this. Place the regions of the brain stem and because this isn't really great, and this is just so we know about the brain. Scary but dope. My parents work for the NHS, so I have to go to school. Oof. I'm gonna be honest, I actually miss school and stuff because I miss seeing my friends and all that. F. Yeah. I kind of wish that, like, school would come back on. I know that people are gonna call me crazy, but. That's just me. And now I shall have an Oreo. Because we are learning about the brain. Ah! Oreo just fell. That's fine. Nom 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 nom. Why is the moon out? It's daytime. I mean, that's just how space works. Alright. I know how. I have all people should know how space. No, I agree. I want school back. Yeah. I talked to my other friends about it and they said they wanted it back too. Not, especially not for the work element, but, you know, just for seeing everyone. Yeah, there's like. I can't. I 
crush these parts of the brain. Some stinking mini horse. I don't know what the deal with that is. Um, hogs. All the lobes and stuff are over there. No cussing in this Christian server. Excellent. Nice. Continue. You have Space is broken. <laughs> two dimensional representations of each of the large parts of the brain. Okay, we're almost done with this. Now let's look at the entire brain using a three-dimensional model. Even this is great. Divided into smaller parts. Oh no! Do this. Oh man. Okay, I didn't realize that we had to do that. Dang. We've we've done this wrong. <laughs> I understand why they would close school though. Um. Yeah. It's gonna be warning. I'm gonna be the warning that tells people to drink water. <laughs> Gotta stay hydrated. We can see that they all fit together to form one organ. We can see the cerebrum, cerebellum, and brainstem. This all sits inside your skull and keeps your body working. Inside your skull. Now that we've seen all the parts of Minecraft brain cat? general locations, let's wrap things up with some I thought, practice. I swear I just heard of Minecraft Match the cat. part of the brain with the correct letter. Okay. That's the cerebellum, that's the frontal lobe, C is the pogs, and B is the cerebellum. Oh wait, what? Uh-oh. That's the part to your lobe. Right, Great. okay. In this lesson, we looked at the major parts of the brain, including the cerebellum, And we're done. I think that I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here. I got to go eat dinner and stuff. Um, I'm still surprised that we actually got people to watch me legit do homework. Um, thank you everyone for joining in. This was a bit of a shorter stream, you know, than normal, but, you know, then again, legit doing homework. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you all super much for joining in. I will see you all next time, and peace.